What is going on guys? This week we are out at the River to Ridge event hosted by Coyote Off-Road, which is just a uh, big dual sport event hosted in Wenatchee, Washington. Actually just outside of Kashmir technically. But we have been uh, asked to come out, help them out with a little bit of filming. We also sponsored the event and it uh, should be a good time. Greg, do you know what uh, Kashmir is known for? Uh, Apples and cutlets. Nope. Sun. Sunshine. Go here. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. So then you're gonna proceed out this, yep. and it's five miles. From and then basically this entire area. So they'll be coming in first. Okay. So they're gonna follow this road, and they're gonna. This is this is really the off-road portion of it. We're gonna be out there super early. Yeah. Probably we even camp at like 5:30 to go okay. fuel up, get more water, yep. and then go get some early morning shots, and okay. then we'll just hang out. So all day tomorrow, they're gonna be riding a whole bunch of dual sports. I hear there's probably about 85, 90 different riders out there. And we're gonna use Evo to uh, try to track them through the woods a little bit. Hopefully I don't hit any trees, but it uh, should be fun. Let's go. <coughs> what time is it? Uh, it looks to be about... Go fly drones time. Good one. Uh, no, it's 5.13 in the morning. And I think we're the only people awake. So right now we are getting some establishing shots of the area and some safety shots as well. In case anything happens, then we already know that we have some good stuff. Now that we got some establishing shots of the area, before I erase my SD card, I'm going to actually transfer it over. And Western Digital was nice enough to send us one of their drives. They thought that this might be pretty useful for someone like us that is out in the field and needs to transfer content all the time. Maybe you have limited SD cards, you just want to back up, whatever you want. Uh, so this should be pretty easy to use and let's try it out. So I am going to turn it on. If you can see that, looks like it is on. It has wireless so I can check it on the app. So right now it's trying to connect and the hard drive is on. I've got my drone card in a, in a full size SD card adapter. I should be able to just push this thing in. And then hit the transfer button. Okay, sweet. So now that first light is blinking, saying that it is transferring from the SD card. Now we got a second light there. So something like this would be super useful for us because we're filming all the time but we don't want to, you know, gaff tape like SD cards or anything like that. So I could just drop it onto this and instantly have a backup and then if I want to confirm it, I could just connect to it with their app on my phone and make sure all our stuff is there before we format cards. So it's rugged, drop proof. Thanks Western Digital. Thanks guys. Tracking dirt bikes through the woods is uh, never a bad time, so that's cool. What's the best advice for tracking dirt bikers in a forest? Know your route first, so then you're not trying to like stop and go try to figure out where all the trees are. And err to the side of caution unless you have a whole bunch of drones that you can crash. 
So if you think you're getting out of control, then just stop and reevaluate. Hopefully there's another shot you can get. Next. Check this out. We are going through quite a few batteries and just a quick tip for you guys is that I make sure that I always hold the Evo to swap out my batteries instead of pushing it down onto the ground and then swapping the battery this way. It's pretty convenient this way, but you can see it starts to put a lot of stress on these legs and underneath here. So these all have metal joints inside them, but the plastic housing out, out here just isn't really used to that much force with the arm uh, being pushed down on it. So I always make sure that I hold it in one hand and then clip it in. It's also just easier to do it that way and then you get that nice uh, solid click to make sure that your battery is attached. Let's go. Even with like fast moving objects, I try not to be in 34 or ludicrous mode all the time, just because you're doing a lot of things on the controls already. Plus you're trying to follow a human being. And so if you were to bump to full throttle all of a sudden, I don't want the drone to just rocket into that object or that person. Uh, I want it to still sort of limit me as it goes uh, in and out of different things. We spent a lot of time before the event and last night scouting and sitting down with the event organizers to go over the map so we know the general route, we can see the markers, we know where they're gonna go, but then also just knowing the environment and having experience here has helped out quite a bit. So if you are in a new environment too, uh, make sure you scout it out properly uh, and try to drive or ride or, or pre-fly the route that you're going to do. Uh, and then you're not caught off guard uh, and surprised by those sorts of things. You wanna mitigate that as much as possible. What? Is that a built-in OLED display? Hell yeah. Sick. All right guys, that's it. That wraps up our day of out in the mountains filming dirt bikes. And uh, I gotta say it was a good time. So thank you to Coyote Off-Road for inviting us out. Also thank you to uh, Western Digital because this actually made our life a lot easier. We simply just put the SD card in after uh, landing the drone and it uploaded the content and created a backup right away. So that saves us an hour, two hours worth of work back at the office and then we can work directly off this. And I know Greg was actually uh, reviewing some of the footage while we we're sitting here in the truck uh, just over his phone and through the app. So thank you for letting us try this. Uh, I think it's definitely something we will add to the kit. But anyways, I will talk to you guys later. Uh, if you like this kind of content, please leave us a comment on what you'd like to see next. Hit that like button and remember to subscribe. We'll see you later. Bye.